Whenever you're working around your battery, you should always be wearing your safety glasses. Actually, it's a good idea to have them on all the time when working around your car. The battery in the BMW Z3 models is located in the right side of the trunk under the carpet and indicated by the green arrow. When replacing your battery, make sure to use a high quality unit. Read our battery connection notes before disconnecting the battery. Also make sure the key is out and you've noted your radio presets. When the battery loses connection, dies, or is replaced, certain things, depending on how your car is equipped, will need to be reset. Like the clock, your radio codes, you may need to reinitialize the power windows, and sunroof. You can connect a battery charger directly to the battery or under the hood at the positive and negative grounding point junction. The battery junctions are located at the right front strut tower. Red arrows point to the battery positive, blue arrow points to the battery negative. However, I suggest removing the battery from the vehicle while charging. This will avoid filling your trunk with gases the battery emits during charging. Follow your manufacturer's instructions on setting and using your battery charger. To jumpstart your vehicle, a vehicle with a discharge battery can be jumpstarted using a good battery or a good battery in another vehicle. When jump starting, be sure to work in a well ventilated area. Batteries can produce an explosive gas. Wear gloves and eye protection, and if battery acid comes in contact with your skin, immediately flush with water and seek medical assistance. Move both vehicles close together, but do not allow them to touch. Turn the ignition off in both vehicles. Unclip and remove the positive terminal cover indicated by the green arrow. Connect one end of the positive jumper cable to the positive battery terminal of the vehicle with the good battery. Connect the other end of the positive jumper cable to the positive junction terminal, red arrow, on the vehicle with the discharge battery. You will have to flip open the lid on the positive junction connection. Connect one end of the negative cable to the negative battery terminal of the vehicle with a good connection. Connect the other end of the negative jumper cable to the negative junction terminal, blue arrow, of the vehicle with the discharge battery. Start the engine on the vehicle with the good battery. Allow it to idle, then raise the engine to 2000 RPM. Next, start the engine of the vehicle with the discharge battery. Once the vehicle with the discharge battery starts, shut off all electrical accessories, radio, HVAC, blower, etc. Carefully disconnect the jumper cable in the reverse order you connected them and allow the vehicle with the dead battery to idle to recharge the battery. To replace the battery, you're going to be working in the trunk. Begin by lifting and removing the trunk carpet by pulling it straight out. Pull the negative terminal protective cover off the terminal, green arrow. Then loosen the 10 millimeter nut on the negative battery cable, yellow arrow. Remove the negative cable and place it out of the way in a place where it cannot come in contact with the terminal while replacing the battery. Loosen the 10 millimeter battery hold down fastener, green arrow, and then remove the battery hold down. Pull the positive terminal protective cover off the terminal, green arrow. Then loosen the 10 millimeter nut and remove the positive cable, yellow arrow. Place it somewhere it can't come in contact with the terminal while replacing the battery. Disconnect the battery vent hose and lay it aside. Lift the battery up and remove it from the trunk. Be careful and make sure you have a good grip. The battery is quite heavy. Clean the battery compartment thoroughly and any corrosion from the battery cables. Before installing your new battery, check the battery vent line. Make sure it is not pinched, that it's in good condition and properly routed. Install the battery in the compartment and attach the vent line. Connect the positive cable and install the cover. Connect the negative cable and install the cover. Install the battery hold down bracket, then reinstall the trunk carpet and you are done besides resetting your presets. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.